You can always view files on your computer, but sometimes it's nice to have hard copies. Hi, I'm Jean White, a writer on the Windows team. In the next three minutes, I'm going to show you some options so you can get your printed pages to look exactly how you want. If you just want to print and you're in a hurry, you don't even have to open the file. Click the file and then click print. It's fast and simple. If you already have a file open, like I do, you can click the print button here too. You'll see a button like this in most programs and even on your web browser toolbar so you can print documents, pictures, and web pages. However, I like to preview my work before I print it. That way, if it doesn't look right, I can change it without wasting paper. I can change the look of the page here too, just by clicking Page Setup. Here's where I can change the paper size. I usually use letter, which is the standard paper size, and sometimes legal, but you can get fancy with special layouts for cards, menus, and flyers if you'd like. Another thing you might want to do is change the direction of the paper, which is called orientation. You have two options, portrait and landscape. Portrait displays the page vertically, like this. Landscape orients the page horizontally, like this. Let's go with landscape. You can change the margin width and other settings too. Once you're happy with the settings, click OK. When you click the print button, you'll see the print dialog box. Here's where you can select the printer. If your document has several pages, you can choose exactly which pages you want to print. For example, type 1-3 to print the first three pages. You can also print more than one copy at a time. Click these arrows to select a number, or type how many copies you want to print. When everything looks good, click Print. Printing is similar for most programs, but there are differences. For example, when I want to print a picture, I'll see this dialog box. I can still choose a printer, paper size, and the number of copies. And I can even preview my pictures in different sizes. That's it. Now you know how to use printer options so you can change the look of your files before you print them.